the employer getting um, the LMIA, the um, employee getting the work permit. Uh, let's talk about what is it that's beneficial for the employer to actually hire a foreign national. Are there any benefits? Yes, yes, there are. There are benefits. Um, first and foremost, um, as an employer, you will definitely cut your labor costs. Okay. Um, not only that, your training costs will go down, uh -huh. and you will build stability. And um, I'll, I'll just sort of speak a little bit about all of that. What happens is that uh, a lot of Canadians do not are or are not involved in the skilled labor space. Um, so you'll find as a as an, a Canadian. You, as an employer, you will hire a Canadian, and in a matter of weeks, they're not there. Okay. And so you've already spent a lot of money training, yes. and you, you not only are you losing money, but you're also losing time. Yes. When you hire a foreign national, this foreign national is committed to you for at least a minimum of two years. That's amazing. And, and, and not only that, they want to be there, which is another thing. Because that also, if I can even talk about help, um, helping the morale, of the company because now you have employees that are committed and that also brings stability. So yes. it, 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 it actually benefits you in so many ways that you know you, you can find, uh, you'll find um, even when I think about some of the employers that I've helped, a lot of them uh, are literally will find that they will hire somebody today and tomorrow the person is gone, wow. right? And uh, so what they will do, they will literally go out and find unskilled labor just to fill the space. Just to have a body in the space. Just to have a body in the space. Yeah. Well, that definitely will cut into your labor cost. Exactly. And so, so labor cost, uh, stability, and what about training um, your foreign national? Um, what happens there? That's that's another thing. A lot of the foreign nationals, because they are they're already coming with certificates, they've already been so they're trained. So all you need to do is now spend limited time in terms of training them to the company standard, right? And and a lot of them are eager to learn because the more they learn is the is the more they will be pleasing to you. And is the more because again, don't forget in certain situations, these foreign nationals can also become perm. And you as an employer uh, enjoying working with them can also bring that to come to pass. What, what is perm? Sorry, sorry permanent. Oh, very good. <laughs> sorry, right. sorry. So, so basically, um, an employer will have someone for two years and really could have that employee forever if they want. Exactly. They can have a lifer exactly. because that person can become a permanent resident in Canada and continue working for the company. That is great news. Yes. That's that's money saving news. Money and saving news. You're gonna help them from start to finish. That is beautiful. And that's what I know that people are looking for, especially with the labor shortage that we have going on. So this is great news.